My name is Dr. Umar Sehbaz Khan. I am the director of the National Center of Robotics and Automation. The National Center of Robotics and Automation was established in 2018. The center works under the umbrella of the Higher Education Commission. The center is a consortium of labs established in 13 top universities in Pakistan. Our labs are working on various domains of robotics and automation. Over the past few years, we have developed capacities and capabilities and enabled our researchers to develop products in this cutting edge area to make the future products of robotics and automation. Our labs are working in the domains of agricultural robotics, biomedical robotics, unmanned ground vehicles, autonomous vehicles, microelectromechanical systems, haptics and tele-robotics, railway inspection systems, and hardware and software in loop testings. The vision of this particular center is to support indigenization so that there is import substitution, provide HR in this uh, cutting edge area, and support the local industry as well. We uh, participated in development of the national drone policy. Besides that, we are also actively involved in developing policies for 3D printing and other advanced equipments. We have introduced drones in the agriculture sector. We have also introduced unmanned ground vehicles and robots for security purposes. We have developed our own indigenous multi-degree of freedom robots that can be used in the industry. In the future, we see that these labs are going to grow and they are going to participate in the form of Made in Pakistan products. And our goal is to convert this nation into a technology nation. Having access to advanced equipment, we have also have a training program. This would not have been possible without the constant support of the Higher Education Commission, Planning Commission, and the government of Pakistan in entrusting us with this task of developing this technology in the nation. And we are hopeful that in the near future, many of our products will be seen in the local and the international market. A lot has been gained in the center, but still there is room for advancement. And for that, we would always be looking forward to the support of government, higher education commission, and the universities that have hosted the labs.